Hi, this is Keith on Monday, October 22nd at 5 a.m. And today I'm going to have another talk on language learning. Uh, let's see here. What did I want to say today? Today I want to tell you that, uh, of course, most of you know input is what you need for language learning. You need input and you need lots and lots of input. Now I believe that uh, no matter of course how much you might try to study you will not become anywhere near fluent until you have had a lot of input. And if, of course, if you're not like in the country already working and uh, required to use the language, but if you are at home studying, starting a new language, or working on whatever language for a while already, why not just get the input you need and get used to the sound and the words and uh, understand, try to understand naturally, understand normally, and get all the input. There's probably no reason to be in a hurry if you're learning for, for fun, for your amusement, for your interest. Get a lot of input then, after you understand the language, then try speaking and see how well you do. Because, you know, you can spend a lot of time, you know, just studying or you can spend a lot of time trying to speak when you don't even know how to understand uh, the responses. But uh, even though you do all of that, it's still going to require a lot of input, a lot of listening or watching, watching TV shows or something. You're going to need lots of input, and there's really no exception. Um, show me an exception where a person who is not, uh, what's that word, who's not a savant, a person who didn't get a lot of input and could speak. Um, all the input is a requirement, so why not do it first? Why not do the input, get it in, understand the language, then start to speak. At least you'll be able to understand what people say back to you. And listen and speak after all the input. If there's some reason you're in a hurry, please tell me why you're in such a hurry. Um, I think most of the time we have some illusions that we can learn a language in uh, a short amount of time. All we need to do is hurry up and get there, get to that point. But there's no shortcuts, there's no skipping steps, there's no, mm, there's no way you're going to be able to say things you've never heard before. And of course I don't see how a person can be confident speaking if they have never heard what they want to say, if they've never heard anybody say it before. So lots of input first. You know if you're in a hurry because it's it's uh, easy 
easier to get the input. It's easier than studying. And if you do it right, if you do it naturally, you will be able to understand the language. It requires input. You're going to have to get that anyway. So get the input, understand the language, and then try speaking. What do you think about that? Let me know. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.